Hey guys, welcome back. Glad you are here with me tonight. It's a little chilly today, so we're keeping warm. We're gonna cool it right down. We're gonna do a yin yoga style today. So go ahead and get a couple pillows, get your mat set out, um, get yourself ready to be comfortable. Hello, hello, you guys. We're gonna do a yin yoga tonight. So again, if you remember, that is much slower paced. We're gonna just chill out. I'm gonna cold, hence my hat and cozy gear today. Um, go ahead and get two pillows. You will want them to prop yourselves up because we are gonna be in uh, some positions for several minutes. So um, go ahead, get your pillows, get your mat, get a drink of water, and then work your way all the way down. Give you guys just a moment or so to get your stuff. Ignore Lenny, I'm trying to eat my plants over here. Leave them alone, Mr. Cat. <laughs> so apparently he's gonna be with us tonight too, so enjoy. Hopefully he doesn't try to bite me. Occasionally he gets a little too wild when I start petting him, and then he's like, I'm just gonna eat you. All right, you guys, let's come on down to your mat. Get into a nice, comfortable cross-legged position. We're gonna sit up nice and tall. We'll start here and then we will transition into doing some of those still poses that we'll be in for several minutes. So the focus of today, I really want you guys to really pay attention to your breath. Um, it's gonna be extremely necessary, uh, both for our body, but also when you start to feel an ache within a pose, the more you can come back to your breath, you can help reduce that tension throughout and overall just feel a little bit better. So come on down to your mat. Make sure you have a couple pillows with you if you're just joining and uh, get yourselves nice and comfortable. Sitting up nice and tall, bring your hands onto your lap and go ahead and close your eyes. Taking a big inhale in through the nose and out. Inhaling in, exhale, let it go. Again, making sure you're sitting up nice and tall here. Pull your chin towards that back wall, even creating that nice alignment through our neck all the way down. Notice if you're already holding in that tension, Just pay attention to where you're holding in Contract that muscle group and then relax and focus on your breath. Big inhale in through the nose and out. I want you to feel as if you are really truly bringing oxygen into all six sides of our body, the top, the bottom, the left, the right, the front, the back. Inhale, expand all sides. Exhale, pull your belly button into your spine, press that air out. Inhale. Exhale. In. Out. Relax your shoulders down away from your ears. Again, notice if you're leaning forward, rounding forward, sit up nice and tall. Pull your body towards that back wall just a little bit until it feels probably a little uncomfortable. Then you're most likely in perfect alignment. Take a big inhale in and out. Really focus on that breath. Notice how it makes you feel. And let it go. Pay attention to how that breath feels as it enters into the body. The coolness on the nostrils, down the back of the throat, the expansion of the ribs, your lungs, and then the warmth as you release it back into the air. Notice what emotions you might be feeling right now in our
our present moment. Whether they're good, whether they're not, just notice them. Doesn't mean you have to own them. Accept them or let them go. We hold on to the positivity. We let go of that negativity. All of the stuff that doesn't serve us. We focus on that breath. And if you're finding it difficult to focus on your breath versus having all that chatter going in your brain, I want you to start to count your breath at any point throughout our session. One on the inhale, two on the exhale, three, four, and keep that going until you get to 10 and then start again. inhale open your eyes and we're going to transition into a kneeling position on our mat so first come into our tabletop and then just send your hips back towards your heels tuck that pelvis under slightly here sit up nice and tall bring your hands right onto your thighs here take that right hand to your chin press it back in space again creating that alignment in your neck take a big inhale in Exhale, lower those shoulders down your spine. Inhale. And exhale. Keep that breath going. Inhaling in. Exhale, close your eyes. Becoming one with your breath. Visualizing it move through your body. Visualizing it moving to any area of discomfort. Any area of tension. Any area that needs to be restored. Visualize that breath fully, completely healing you at a cellular level, in our DNA. And helping you come back to the person that you know you're meant to be. Take one more big inhale in and out. You can keep your knees together as we transition into our child's pose, or you can open them as wide as the mat uh, like we've done in the past. This would be a really great opportunity to also bring in your pillows so that way we can start at a higher level while we haven't warmed anything up. We release our body here, and then after several breaths, you'll find that you can take away a pillow or two. So get yourselves ready, and then come all the way down into our child's pose, resting your head onto your pillows, relaxing your arms down onto the mat. Again, you can keep your knees close to the center, releasing through that low back, or you can open them as wide as the mat, releasing through your hips. Find what your body needs and adjust. Big inhale in through the nose. Exhale, close your eyes. Allow your shoulders to roll forward. Allow yourself to just surrender here in this pose. Relaxing, releasing, restoring. Really focus on that breath. Use the biggest inhales that you can throughout our practice. Really feel that oxygen 
moving to the deepest part of your lungs. Inhale. Exhale. Keeping a nice steady breath as we inhale and as we exhale. And whatever comes up for you in this practice, just honor it. Whether it's something that you find within your body, an ache or a pain or an area of discomfort that you weren't aware of, just breathe through it. Or maybe it's an emotion. Feel the emotion. Don't let it consume you. Breathe through it and let it go. Again, with every breath, you'll find you may make subtle changes to your pose, removing a pillow, allowing your body to stretch a little bit farther, opening yourself up, releasing through those muscles. Inhaling in through the nose. And out. Bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of one thing that you're grateful for from today. Really feel those deep breaths going deep into your lungs. And out. Feel your body starting to release. Notice if that mental chatter has slowly started to simmer down. And if it hasn't, we count our breath. One on the inhale, two, three, four, inhale slow and steady find your flow all the way back up into our tabletop position bringing your knees right underneath of your hips your wrists right underneath of your shoulders go ahead and curl your toes under and with your next inhale send your hips to the sky bring your chest towards your thighs downward facing dog inhaling in and out Loop those shoulders back and down your spine like you're tucking them in your back pockets. It's okay if you have a bend in your knees or your heels lifted. With time, you'll gain that flexibility. Focus on your breath. Big inhale. And exhale. With your next inhale, walk yourself all the way to the front of your mat. Coming into our forward fold, releasing your upper body over your lower body, getting a nice generous bend in your knees, relaxing your head down. Take opposite hand to opposite elbow. Find a slight sway left and right. Focusing on that breath, inhaling in and out. Inhale back to center. And exhale, release your hands down. Inhale into our half one lift, coming into a nice flat back here. Exhale, fold. Inhale, slow and control. Roll all the way up to standing into our mountain pose. Lengthen through your legs. Tuck that tailbone under. Loop those shoulders up. 
back and down when you get to the top. Open your palms to the wall in front. Go ahead and close your eyes. Pull that chin back towards the back wall. Take a big inhale in and out. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, lift all 10 toes up off the mat. One more big inhale. Exhale, release your toes. Go ahead and open your eyes. You're gonna take one of your feet behind the other, crossing over that ankle. Slow and control, come all the way back down into a seated position. Extend your legs out long in front of you. This is where you may wanna have a pillow or two on your lap. We're gonna go into a seated forward fold. I want you to bring your hands, palms up, right at your side. Just allow your feet to splay open. It's okay if you have a bend in your knees. Take a big inhale in. And exhale, fold over. Whether you are just relaxing your head forward, or if you are folding completely, bringing your body onto your pillows. Find what's comfortable for you, find your variation. Focus on that breath, inhaling in and out. Inhale, exhale, sinking forward just slightly. Not rushing our body into anything, just staying here with our breath, allowing our body to relax, to restore, to repair. Let go of any tension you have in your neck, just tuck your chin into your chest. Feel the lengthening through the neck, through the spine. And maybe inch yourself a little farther forward, tucking your chin into your chest, focusing on your breath, inhaling in and out. Take your hands on top of your legs, lengthening them forward. Again, relaxing your upper body over your lower body. No tension here. Just finding what's comfortable for you. Inhaling in and out. Feel that oxygen going deep into your lungs. Visualize it, repairing your body, repairing the muscles, repairing the ligaments, repairing the tendons, repairing the blood cells, repairing your organs, repairing your brain. Whatever it is that you need repaired, send all of your attention there with every single breath. Make sure we're using those big, deep breaths, filling up your lungs, allowing your body to relax, noticing yourself sinking even further into the poses. With that next inhale, slow and controlled, Roll that upper body all the way up. Loop your shoulders up, back and down. Do that one more time. Inhale, lifting those shoulders. Exhale, releasing them down. 
Go ahead and cross your legs and roll forward into our tabletop position. Take a big inhale in. Exhale, curl your toes, send your hips all the way up, downward dog. Focusing on your breath, big inhale in. And out. Inhale, lift that left leg off the mat, holding it there, keeping your hips parallel to the ground. And as you exhale, we're going to shift forward into plank, bringing that left knee to the left wrist and your foot over to the right wrist, sending your leg behind you back even farther, planting those palms, flexing through that left foot. You can uncurl your right toes. Inhale, lengthen up through that upper body. And as you exhale, we're going to slowly work our way down. Again, you can bring those pillows right underneath of your chest to support you coming down. Bringing those forearms down. And then when you're ready, releasing one pillow at a time, the deeper that you fall into your stretch. Get yourself nice and comfortable. Actively take that left hip Pull it towards the back wall and bring your right hip towards the front wall. Keeping our hips nice and parallel, feeling that deep stretch through the entire left side. Inhaling in, big breath. Exhale, let it go. Again, visualize all of that oxygen going to the left side of your leg, your glute, your lower back and just helping you release, relax, stretch it out. Use your breath to help guide you through. Inhaling in and out. And again, notice what might come up for you. In a pose like this, this is an extremely deep stretch for an area that we tend to often forget about or don't spend as much time as we need to, right? And when we have that tension, sometimes it's coming from a deeper cause. It's not necessarily just that you've been physically demanding on your body, but sometimes you've just been holding in some emotions and they get stuck in our tissue, in the fascia, in the muscle. And this is our time to use our breath to relax, restore, and repair. Big inhale in. Exhale, let it go. Make sure you've got a nice flexed left foot, keeping that knee safe. And just focus on that breath here. Notice where you're holding in that tension and just let it go. One more big inhale in. And as you exhale, go ahead and plant those hands, set your pillow aside, curl your right toes under, lift that knee off the mat, and slowly come all the way back into our downward dog. Inhaling in. You might be able to feel a difference between that left leg and that right leg. Take one more big inhale in. And out. Inhale, lift the right toes off the mat this time, keeping your hips nice and parallel. And then as you exhale, look forward, shift forward, coming into pigeon on the right side. 
Release that left knee down, uncurl those toes. Walk that leg back in space if you need to. Flex your right foot. Inhale, lengthen through your upper body. And exhale, slow and controlled. Work your way all the way down to the mat. Inhaling in. And out. Starting up a little higher than normal, allowing your body to ease into the pose. <clears throat> Focus on your breath here. Big inhale. And exhale. See if you can release a little lower this time. That might mean stack one fist on top of the other, rest your forehead onto your fists. And use those big deep breaths all the way to the base of your lungs. Notice where you're holding that tension and let it go. <clears throat> Bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a second thing that you're grateful for from today. starts to come up, just acknowledge it, let it pass by, and focus on your breath. Notice where you're holding in that tension, and just let it go. Know that it's not serving you. give you permission to release it from your body. Give yourself permission to release it from your body. And when these poses become a little intense, we just bring our attention back to the breath, inhaling in and out. With your next inhale, bring your hands down to the mat. Lift that upper body all the way up. Get a nice stretch here. Exhale, curl your left toes under, plant your palms down. We're lifting that left knee just to sweep our right leg back. We're gonna come into our tabletop, taking a big inhale in and out. I'm gonna shift towards you on the screen. You do not need to. I want you to open your legs as wide as you can. You're going to bring your feet out. Now I want you to make sure you have a 90 degree bend in your legs here. We're going to get a nice deep hip stretch here. So take a big inhale. We're going to lengthen through our chest and exhale. We're going to fold forward, feeling that stretch, staying where it's comfortable for you for now. You may be able to walk your knees out a little farther later, but for now, find what's comfortable as we go into this really deep frog stretch. Flex your feet, keep a 90 degree so we keep all of our joints safe. Inhaling in and out. Inhale. And as you exhale, you can either bring your pillows in front of you and release yourself onto your pillows and you can slowly start to open your forearms, releasing your forehead down onto your fists, keeping a nice bend in your knees, in your ankles, and allowing your body to fully sink into the floor. Focus on that breath, big inhale, and 
and exhale. Inhaling in. Exhale, letting it go. Again, notice what's coming up. Notice where you're holding in that tension. Notice what emotions you're feeling. Notice the changes that might be happening to your breath. Inhaling in. And out. Try to keep each breath the same length as you inhale and exhale. And again, if your mind starts to wander, start to count that breath. Working your way to 10, and then you start again. Release your shoulders down your spine, taking that pressure out of your upper body. And again, we relax, restore, repair, using our breath, visualizing where we want that breath to go within the body. Inhale, slow and control. Lift your upper body away from the mat. And we're going to roll our hips back. Send our legs out in front of us. It's nice and wide here. And we're going to get a wide-legged forward fold. So you'll want to bring your pillows in front of you. Take a big inhale and lift your arms all the way up. Big stretch here. And as we exhale, release over your pillows. You may have to turn them to get as much height as you can until your body is ready to release. You can roll the flesh from your sit bones so you're shifting your weight forward onto your pelvis. And we just breathe, inhaling in and out. You can close your eyes. Start to visualizing that oxygen rushing through your body into your bloodstream, into your organs, into the soft tissue, the connective tissue, into every single part in your body. And just restoring it, repairing it, because it's also needed. Notice where you're holding in that tension and just let it go. Focus on those big breaths here. Inhaling in. And out. Allowing your body to sink a little farther forward into the stretch. Maybe that means removing a pillow for you or turning it down so it's a little lower or unstacking your fists. Take a big inhale in and out. And bring a smile onto your lips. And I want you to think of a third thing that you're grateful for from today. next inhale use your hands to help press your upper body away from the mat set your pillows aside we're going to turn back 
onto our mat, legs extended out in front. Inhale, lengthen your arms, reach forward, get a nice big deep stretch here. And then as we exhale, we're gonna slow and control, release ourselves all the way down to the mat, coming into our final resting pose, Savasana. You're more than welcome to take one of your pillows and put it underneath of your head if that's comfortable for you. Or you just allow your body to become one with the ground. Close your eyes if you haven't already. Take a big inhale in. And out. Really focus on that breath. Inhaling in. And out. And just allowing your breath to help you relax, to restore, and to repair your body and your mind. Allow your hands to fall open, palms open to the ceiling, legs fall as wide as the mat. And just focus on that breath. And when you feel your mind starting to wander, just count the breath, holding your attention there as we move into our savasana. With your next inhale, go ahead and wiggle your toes, wiggle your fingers, bat your eyelashes open and closed, and when you're ready, roll onto your side facing me, and we'll all take a breath there. Inhaling in, and out. Inhale, press yourself up and away from the floor. Coming into a cross-legged position, sitting up nice and tall. Bring your hands into your lap, close your eyes. Take a big inhale. And exhale. Bring your palms together all the way up to your forehead. Inhaling in. And out. Finding your thoughts, yourself and others. Bring your hands down to your lips. Inhaling in. 
and out. Be kind in your words to yourself and others. Just breathe. Bring your hands down to your heart center. One more big inhale in. And out. Be kind in your actions to yourself and others. Inhaling in. And with your exhale, bow forward. The light in me sees the light in you. Namaste. I hope you guys are all feeling relaxed, restored, and repaired tonight. I wanted to give you guys an extra little treat because, you know, it's a special day. And we all deserve to take care of ourselves, whether you are a mom, an aunt, a sister, even the dad playing the role as a single parent. Right, so honor who you are, take time for yourself, and be an awesome human. So I hope you guys have a wonderful night, and I will see you guys again soon. Bye.